now question of the day two particle of masses 10 kg and 35 kg are connected with four string at a point b and d that point b and that point d okay four string here t1 t2 t3 t4 four string tension corresponding to that one d b and d b that point b mass of b point is 10 kg and mass of that one is how much 35 kg okay determine tension in various segment of a string okay so how can be determined clear or not what is the meaning of that one basically two masses are given two block masses corresponding to that one is 10 kg and that one is how much 35 kg four string that one that one that one and that one okay if you consider here t1 here t2 here t3 here t4 four string okay so our motor determine t1 t2 t3 t4 tension in determine the tension in various segment of the string so our motor determine t1 t2 t3 t4 okay so first of all make free by diagram of that block a b and d okay the whole system in equilibrium so first of all here tension t1 so here tension t1 here in this is in tension t2 that is also t2 here t3 that is also t3 okay here t4 then also t4 here or not okay now and second one that angle is how much foot sorry that angle is 45 degree okay here 35 sorry 37 degree so that angle also 37 degree okay because of that line and that line are parallel that's why okay now if you draw point d here t1 represent here t2 represent here mg corresponding to mg is given 350 newton already okay newton okay so after that simply component of t1 t2 okay that one is how much sorry that one is 45 degree and that one is 37 degree okay so t1 cos 45 okay and here t1 sin 45 here t2 sin 37 degree here t2 cos 37 degree okay clear or not now so particle particle <coughs> is in equilibrium equilibrium so net force net force on b and d are zero okay means or you can say that that one and that one also zero okay so first of all we are focus on at point d at point d okay that is d point so t1 this will equal to simply t1 sin 45 
माइनस टी टू साइन थर्टी सेवन इज इक्वल टू जीरो सो टी वन साइन फोर्टी फाइव इज वन बाई रूट टू इज इक्वल टू टी टू साइन थर्टी सेवन दैट इज जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स ओके क्लियर और नॉट सो वॉट अबाउट टी वन टी वन इज रिटर्न एज जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स रूट टू टी टू दैट इज इक्वेशन नंबर वन एंड सेकेंड वन टी वन कॉस फोर्टी फाइव प्लस टी टू कॉस थर्टी सेवन दिस इज इक्वल टू थ्री फिफ्टी थ्री हंड्रेड फिफ्टी ओके आफ्टर दैट नाउ पुट दिस वैल्यू टी वन इज रिटर्न एज हियर वेरी केयरफुली put this value t1 that is 0.6 into root 2 t2 plus in, into cos 45 cos 45 is 1 by root 2 so written like that one and here t2 into cos 37 that is 0.8 this that is 350 okay clear or not after that root 2 root 2 cancel out 0.6 plus 0.8 into t2 this be equal to how much 350 so t2 this be equal to 350 divided by 0.6 plus 0.8 we got how much 1.4 so 350 that is 14 सेवन फाइव जे डिवाइड बाई टू सो टू फिफ्टी न्यूटन सो सॉरी टी टू इज सो फाइनली वी गॉट टी टू इज हाउ मच टू फिफ्टी न्यूटन दैट वैल्यू पुट इन इक्वेशन नंबर वन देन वी गॉट टी वन इज जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स इंटू रूट टू into 250 okay then we got that is 150 root 2 newton okay so finally we got t1 t2 clear or not now we have focus on block b that is block b or you can say that is point uh, that one say particle so particle b okay make free by diagram of block b how can make that is block b and that one is given already weight 100 newton okay here t3 here t2 here t4 okay what about that angle that angle is given how much 30 degree that one is 30 degree and that one is how much 37 degree okay so our first of all component of t1 t3 t2 along y axis and x axis here that one is t2 sin 37 degree here t2 cos 37 degree here t3 cos 30 degree here t3 sin 30 degree okay clear or not so now net force net force along along x axis and y axis also zero x and y axis are zero okay 
and that point is B. because of the system in equilibrium that's why now in x direction that is t3 sin 30 plus t2 sin 37 minus t4 this will equal to 0 so t3 sin 37 sin 30 is 1 by 2 t2 into sin 37 0 0.6 this will be equal to t4 okay and t, t what about t2 is also given 250 so t3 plus 0 0.1 so first of all multiply by 2 that is equation number 3 okay now in y direction t3 cos 30 degree minus t2 cos 37 plus 100 is equal to 0 so you can say that t3 cos 30 degree is equal to t2 cos 37 now t3 cos 30 t2 t2 how much t2 t2 is 250 That is 200 divided by root 3 into 2. So that is 300 into 2 divided by root 3. So multiply by root 3 into root 3. Then we got 200 root 3 Newton. Okay, that is T3. Zero not that is t3 t3 is how much that is 200 root 3 now t3 and t2 put in equation number 3 okay so 2 t4 this will be equal to t3 is 200 root 3 1.2 t2 is how much 250 newton after that if you see very carefully Now that is 200 root 3 plus 250 into 1 year written at 25 into 12. So 200. So first of all, if divided by 2, then we got 100 root 3. Okay plus that one is 25 into 6 now after that 25 into 6 that is how much 150 plus 100 root 3 if you 50 is common then we got 3 plus 2 root 3 Newton that is T4 so finally T1 T2 T3 and T4 Newton and what about T3 200 root 3 Newton T2 is 250 Newton and T1 is how much? 150 Newton.
150 root 2 newton okay t1 t2 is how much t2 is 250 and t1 is clear this is is the right answer if any doubt then comment it i will discuss again make it okay so first of all make free by diagram of block or uh, you can say that that uh, that is a particle b and d so first of all we are making d particle after that b particle then resolve component and you evaluate because net force on b both are in equilibrium so net force on b point b point and d uh, particle b and d are zero so after solving we got the answer okay if end out and comment it i will discuss again